Welcome everyone, I'm Kralis and this is Planet Zoo. So just sit back, relax and enjoy. And ladies and gentlemen, I'm all excited and I just can't hide it. This is a game I've been wanting to try for quite a bit of time, but I haven't had a chance nor possibility because I've been traveling so much lately. However, here I am, all hyped up, ready to play. And this is a game genre I grew up on, like the tycoony building games. This is just my game, so I really, really hope you guys will enjoy it. And also, thanks so much to Frontier for sponsoring this first episode, what hopefully is going to become a series on the channel. It all depends on you guys if you want to see this. If you do, please do let me know in the comment section and give this video a like. And if you guys want to try the game yourselves, there's going to be a link for that in the description. So click it and check it out. This is adorable. It's a bunny versus a squirrel, I believe. But uh, we're going to be playing this on my worst nightmare, by the way. We're going to be playing this on a franchise mode, which means money will become limited. And for those who've been around on the channel, you know I love placing trees and bushes literally all over the place. That's not going to be possible. Or maybe. So the question is for today's episode, will we go bust or will we survive? Knowing me, we will go bust because placing bushes. We're also going to be playing this on a European temperate map. Might be a little bit boring, but hey, I live in Europe and those farm fields look absolutely fabulous. But let's -a go. And for those who've been playing the game, don't be upset, okay? This is my first baby steps into the game, okay? So we're going to be doing some paths, I believe. But first, let me take a selfie. Now, you know, first I think I'm going to do some flatten to foundation. Even this costs money. <laughs> We're so gonna go bust today. We're gonna flatten the ground here. Otherwise, I believe the paths might go a little bit wonky. And that is nothing we want to happen. Like a so. And let's just see. Okay, we do have a little bit of grass on the inside, which kind of sucks. But I can fix that by painting grass short, right? I fix. Can we even go inside this? <laughs> okay, I'm a simple man. I love it. And also, we do have a little bit of objectives to begin with. Uh, we need to get ourselves a research center, keeper hut, trade center, staff room, quarantine, workshop, and a vet surgery. So um, let's go. Paths. And we're going to go maybe like... Yes, 8 meters is kind of decent, right? A line to grid. And this is... Okay, I've been playing quite a bit of Plants Coaster, so I guess the path system is pretty much similar. And don't get upset, okay? This is just so we can start making some cash. <laughs> so square and boring. Oh, don't worry, because I think I can do this, right? I can... It's a round shape for the round people. <laughs> Which, by the way, sounds terrible. I'm so sorry. Let's go this extended like so. And by the way, can I move those trees? Uh... Yes, indeed you can. And this one over here. Perfect. So, um, how do we want to go about this? Like, those stuff I don't really want to have on the entrance, right? Because that's pretty much staff stuff. So, let's go... Um, let's go like this. Let's go another path. Uh, and this path is going to be going... Maybe like two in length. Can I snap two? I guess that kind of works. And then on this side, we can have some shoppies and whatnot. And on this side, maybe we can just mirror the shape or do something. Uh... Let's do this. Let's get... Can I get this up like a little bridge? It's all in the details, right? On this side, what we can have, I have a little idea. What if we do a little bridge? And then we can have a little like pond or river. So we come in over here to the park, right? Like, yay! And then we can have a statue of, of an animal. We can have maybe a name of the park. Uh -huh. And then we can have a bridge going over here. And then we can have some exhibits on this or uh, habitats over on this side. And then the shop is on this side. Yeah, how about that? Like that and then we bend it like Beckham. How are we looking? And then we have the river here in between, ladies and gentlemen. I believe, all right? Because what we could do over here is align to grid, uh, square shapes, and let's say we would have, let's say we would have a few shoppies, like a little shopping street over here. So we can have a few shoppies here, benches over here, overlooking the river, and then a lot of trees and bushes later on. I mean, it is, it looks a little bit bland and boring, I guess. It's very square, but uh, a little bit different. <laughs> is it? <laughs> no. <laughs> oh, it's my different, alright? Leave Corral is alone. 
And then let's do a bendy shape here, which just extends like a so. And then we can have habitats over here. The shop is over here. More habitats over here. We just need to make money. One, two, three, four, and then we bend it. One, two, three, four, five, like this. You'll just have to believe, okay? I know it doesn't look like much at this stage, but eventually it might. So let's say I would do like boom, 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 bam, boom, and then we just turn. Oh, okay. So it do come in this. This is kind of nice. This is like... Uh, it's pretty much just the uh, isolation and the framework. And then we can set ourselves uh, the desired uh, exterior. But for the moment, let's just go simple. Uh, 1400 bucks. Holy crap. By the way, can I do... Oh, this would kind of look nice. Because this is going to give us a little bit of a different shape to the, the whole path system, right? So if I would do like this guy here, for example, this is so neat. I mean, look at this, okay? We do have a detailed interior. And look at this. Like, this is a dead little house. And then we just zoom in and we have all this. I know most of you guys, I guess we have seen this all already, but I haven't. So for me, this is like, wow. I'm all about details. <laughs> oh, this is so, so sweet. So cool. Oh crap, okay, that's bigger. But that doesn't matter, right? Or maybe it does? Can I do a staff room? Okay, this might actually be a thing. Let me just see here. People might be screaming, girls, no. And I'm like, y y y yeah, how about no? Boom! I mean, it's not bad. Obviously, they're not gonna have any, any, any window anymore. But, uh... That looks... Oh, no way. Okay, I mean, <laughs> just look at this. I... I kind of love this. Like, we're going to see this operation. Hopefully, people come in there later on and do their business and whatnot. But uh, that is those two buildings. What else was there on our agenda? We had... Was it like a surgery? Vet thingy? Okay, that's a big boy. Maybe I can just place it here in the gap somewhere about, like I saw. Like, oh yeah. Yep, indeed. And then we had a trade center, I believe it was. Trade center, what is that? I believe this is a building where the animal comes in, right? Are we even Steven? I think this is as close as it gets. So we have a trade center. And I believe this building is used, as soon as you buy an animal, it kind of ends up in here. I know it's small, but... uh believe everybody and this is a keeper's hut this is where they prep food and whatnot <laughs> and i'm sorry i just can't get enough of this is that gloves that's even gloves hokey dokey so we have them and we have two more on the agenda a research center and a quarantine also we would need some power uh, for this area and all the buildings and then we can start building barriers and making some habitats i guess and buying some animals just so we get some money cash flow going all right but let's just see here staff alerts research center and a quarantine and uh, quarantine quarantine how big is that oh crap that's a big boy as well and 5k <laughs> this is getting this is getting out of control like so don't do it girls you know what i just want to do it a little bit different i know it's not needed but let's say i would do can i do like this and then okay might be just a waste of space but in my world that might look pretty it's a little bit bendy a bendy shape for the bendy people and then this guy would be going Okay, this is like uh, brain surgeon precision. L like this. Amazing. And the final building was the research center, right? Research. How much is that? That is 1400 almost. Can I just place that next to us? Don't, 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 don't get upset, ladies and gentlemen. Like this. I mean, it's kind of working nicely. Oh, by the way, do we see stuff? Yes, we do. <laughs> okay, I can't wait to see this up in action with people inside. 
Uh, and how about those buildings? Okay, this is this is furnished. Let me just get down a little bit. So this is where all the research and magic happens. And how about the... Okay, so this is nothing on the inside. There's nothing on the inside on this building. And uh, those two we've seen already. But I mean, this kind of works out, right? Oh yeah, then we need the power as well. So before we do anything else, let's get some power up and running. Uh, there's water treatment, Keralis. Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh crap, we need water treatment as well. But let's get a transformer and maybe we can just squeeze that in. Can I just squeeze that in just on the side of the building here? And obviously we can have some bushes all the way around just to hide away the ugliness. But boom! It's a thing! 500 bucks for that! How much do we have? 20k. <laughs> oh, ay, 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 ay. But that is all the buildings we need, at least for the animals, right? So, barriers. How does this even work? So habitats, uh, okay, there's all the stuff we need for inside, I guess shelters and whatnot. Then we have my favorite category, which is the bushes. And there's quite plenty of them to, to choose from. We might even unlock if we research stuff. Facilities, construction, oh yes. One day we're gonna get into this, but uh, we don't have money for this now. Blueprints. Okay, barriers. So what do we choose? We have a few gates, so let's maybe go with the barriers to begin with. We have null. Okay, that is null. Then we have glass, wood logs, red brick, corrugated. Okay, that's a little bit cheap, but it's the cheapest one. Actually, the bushes are the cheapest one. Ah, okay, maybe not. Let's maybe go with the wood logs. Okay, let's just think about this. Let's say we would have a few habitats. Let's get, let's maybe get 8 meters, so we're gonna be even Steven on this. Let's go 8 meters like so. Not a nine girls. Yeah, it's close. And then, how close can I get to the road? The path. Okay. Fair enough. And then I do like this. Oh! Okie dokie. That was not intentional. Should we just bend it, maybe? Or how do we do this? Uh, okay, this doesn't even bend. There's no bend option on this. Like, does glass bend? Okay, glass bends. I guess as long as we don't have, like, dangerous animals in here, we should be good to go, right? Then the animals could be like, Yo, what's that? In between each other. Okay, I take that. I mean, that is... It's a little bit messed up over here. That is not straight. And question if it kills me it does kill me a little bit so let's maybe go boom boom build that wall okay that is kind of kind of nice so then we have those habitats we might even change those uh, over here to this could be a glass wall right or maybe if i move this just a little bit uh, let me see here uh edit barrier please move this just a little bit this way to about here and then we can have a glass part over here boom and glass Hey Mason, I guess we could have glass here as well, but let's let's not. Something like this. Oh, this is how you do it. Okay, so this is how you add those little pillar things. Oh, that's convenient. We need doors as well, gates, right? So where are those guys? Habitat facilities, uh, barriers, corrals, and then gates. So this is a guest gate? No, 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 no. Don't let the people into the tigers. <laughs> There's no tigers. I can guess. I guess can get this guy. Just, I mean, it's kind of nice having those a little bit hidden away from the from the whole public, right? It's not like they're gonna be hidden away. They're still gonna be like visible to the public, but we can hide them away with some rocks or a uh, bush and whatnot. Like this. Am I happy? Well, almost happy. Okay, we're gonna continue make a few other ones over here. Just kind of feels like. They might just be too oversized. That's that's the only thing I'm worried about. Because what, what if the animals hide here in this corner? Then nobody's going to see them because they're just so far away, right? So let's see we would have Gulpi over here. <laughs> Gulpi! Uh, what was that? That was... Uh, is that Chief Beef? That is Chief Beef. I haven't seen Chief Beef in ages. Chief, beef. And then I guess we need a merchandise shop here. Boom! <laughs> balloon. <laughs> it's a me, Mario. Boom! 
done it, no regrets. And then we have some bushes over here, so we have a little like, information kiosk. And I guess we're gonna add ourselves. Don't do it, Corrales. Look at the cash. Okay, maybe just wait with that. But toilets is definitely something we need. Oh, 5k. Like, I don't even have any animals yet, and I'm running out of cash. Can I put it just in the backstages here? Boom! Hello! Everybody open! Where is this? Versi... Okay. There's nobody in the balloon shop. <laughs> this is so nice. But, uh... Am I missing something? Okay, somebody's on the way. Hello! We need a caretaker. So let's get one, two, and three of those guys in. We also would need a keeper for animals. So let's maybe just go over here and pop them down. Let's go one to begin with. Or maybe two, okay? Dang it. I can't afford it. A mechanic is popped in. We would need a security... Oh, look at Mr. Beefcake over here. Holy crap. Uh, let's put him here just on the entrance. There we go. Uh, what else did we need? Vendors, we have a veterinarian. Okay, I guess that is pretty much it. Boom. There we go. And obviously we're going to have, what you're going to call it, uh, trash bins and benches all over the place. But not now. Ooh, hello! <laughs> Look at Mr. Beefcake. Ladies and gentlemen, we need animals. Downside is, I only have 6k remaining to buy animals for. And uh, yeah, how about that? Artwork. <laughs> They're adorable. I've seen one of those up close and personally in the San Diego Safari Park. They're just amazing creatures. The only thing I'm worried about that this might be too big of a compound or a habitat or enclosure for those guys. But for now, should we just... Oh... Let's uh, see here. What do we have? We have quite a bit of species, right? To choose from. Oh my goodness. Look at this. Getting gorillas. But I don't, th I don't think I'm ready for that. I I you know what? I the beginning baby steps, right? Uh, animals, I guess, will die. So what do we have? Artwork, buffalo, elephants, wild dogs. I mean, kind of cool, I guess. Bongos. How about, no, Chinese pangolin. What the crap is this? Giant pandas. Like the thing out, oh copies, oh copies are beautiful. Been up close and personal to those one as well, but they don't really have much of the prestige points. You know what? Let's not be like that. Let's maybe go for the artwork, just to begin with. Zebras, timber wolf. Oh my goodness! But let's go, let's go artwork. <laughs> Such an awkward name as well. Artwork. I don't even know what to go for. Like, we need, I guess, a few females and males. I mean, no, look at that. This is really bad. We need something which uh, which has better genes. I know it's uh, not the best gene pool, but I'm going to get uh, one male over here. Adopt, please do. And I'm going to get this female over here. Boom. Uh, hopefully we bought the correct uh, gender. Because otherwise there's not going to be any babies over here. So how does this operate? We have animal storage. Yay! We do have them over here. So let's... Uh, can I mark them both? No, I can't. So let's move this to this habitat. Okay. And uh, move this. Ah! You're making a funny sound. Does that mean... Low on cash. Episode 1. Ladies and gentlemen... We are bankrupt. How does this operate? Are you, oh, is it you who can I... Oh, so they both clean and uh, bring out the animals. Let me see the animal. Where is it? It's in a box. The donation boxes. Because that is something we need. So let's maybe have one donation box on this side and have one on this side to begin with. Nobody's gonna pay for artwork. <laughs> Hopefully they are. We also need a cash machine, but that, uh, well, just for now, okay? Just is just for now. Let's just put it down over here. We also need some trash bins, but we can't afford. We can't afford nothing. We're gonna go bankrupt. Where's my artwork? <gasps> <laughs> it's an 
adorable. You make baby now. Don't run away. Whoop. Absolutely beautiful. Okay, people might not really see them that much, but we also need to figure out because um, I believe... Hello, Mr. Artwork. Okay, they might be a little bit sad. We need stuff in here, all right? We need food for those guys. Inspectors are arriving in 21 months. Uh, that's gonna be terrible. So how about this? Enrichment. They do have nutrition, social habitats. Uh, hard shelter that we need, I guess. Some short grass. Some grass long is too much. And a little bit of soil. Environment. Okay, so let's do... Let's do this. Let's just pause this a second for a second over here. And uh, let's think about this. So habitats. Those guys would need something to drink of, alright? Uh, do I need to filter species and artwork? There we go. Uh, bedding? Oh, so we do have a little bit of shelters for those guys. Oh, this is this is amazing. A large food a small football for those guys, just here, so people can maybe inspect them while they eat and whatnot. Uh, they would need. A uh, water ball, heater. I don't think you need a heater, right? Let's get this here, just temporarily set up. Boom! We're gonna make this much prettier very, very soon. But uh, now it's just gonna kind of getting the basic needs for those guys. I mean, <laughs> I mean, look at this animal. I, I don't believe. And uh, when will they poop? That is the question. However, is anybody coming to my park? Ladies and gentlemen, I present you. Look at this. Everybody's coming just to see the artworks. Everybody's my buying map. Oh, rise the prices, rise the prices. Uh, let's just hear prices. Uh, audio guide. Okay, that's gonna need, needs to go up. 280. Okay, let's maybe keep like this. But one thing which they will need to pay for is the toilets. Toilets are not going to be cheap. Toilets are going to be a buck per visit. Okay, people are going to hate me, but I don't really care. Hello! Let me see. They're like, uh, what is that? It's an artwork. <sighs> Yay! Ooh. Ladies and gentlemen, I'm... Um, I'm in love with this game. <gasps> oh, the poop cannon! Or I mean the poop vacuum cleaner. <laughs> this is beautiful. So they changed the habitat just a little bit. I've gave them a little pond or a puddle to swim in. And uh, I just believe like this habitat is maybe a little bit too big for those guys. But let's ask. Uh, hello? May I ask you a question? Oh man, they need enrichment. Olga! Get on the artwork. <laughs> Such a funny name. Artwork. Animals. We have two. So, how about... How about getting some, uh, some babies in over here? Uh, yeah, how about that? Let's maybe go. It's gonna take. It's gonna take a little bit of time for me to kind of like learn the game and such. Uh, how about benches? What do we have at this stage? Ooh. Okay, not that cool, I guess. But let's maybe get two of those. And how about uh, trash bins? This is just for now, okay? We're gonna make stuff pretty as soon as we get more cash. <laughs> oh, by the way. Can I do this? Uh, let's just see. Edit. If I mark those guys over here, can I maybe lower that a little bit? Okay, this might stress the animals a little bit, but uh, let's try this. <laughs> this is so nice. Well, maybe not the poop. Like, hopefully they don't, don't get stressed. I'm a little bit worried about the stress levels over here, but uh, so far we kind of kind of good. One thing which I kind of forgot about is, uh, let me see here, facilities and uh, the water treatments. Do we really need that now? I guess, I guess, yeah, you know what, just in case. Let's maybe put it down 
Over here. Over here. This is incredible. Do we have anybody in here? Yeah, look at them. Okay. Might not be the best. Oh. What's happening? <laughs> I don't know. I'm lost for words. Nobody in here? Nope. So it kind of seems to be working. But I want to see a baby. Okay, food is being coming in. How about the water levels? We have water. Don't run away. Make babies. Come on. Oh, this, they love each other. You know what that means? Yes, babies. No, don't run away. Oh, getting all excited. And get, get this up. Like a staircase up. And then... Oh, no, no. Uh, wrong button. Like, I mean... This could be a thing, right? So this would be going, like, all the way to the far end. And maybe stop over here. And then we would... Turn it, maybe? Like, this is just... This is just for testing, okay? Then we could have a habitat on this side, and people will be just walking. I mean, that is going to give them much more space to kind of see the animals, right? As long as we have more animals, as I'm thinking at least. Oh, no, 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 we need street lights. Lights. Where do we place this? Just on the end. So let's maybe just do one on this side as well. Boop. It's a slow beginning, okay? There's just so much in this game. It's kind of overwhelming when you start. How are we feeling? Okay. Stop it! Hi! We've got a ball and we got a large barrel feeder. Okay, so the research did it. So put it down. Uh, over here. Have you seen have you seen a better ball than that? I have never seen a better ball. Go and kick that ball. Kick the ball! Oh no way! You have to be kidding me. Oh no, not over the fence! <laughs> so so sweet. Can you what what is happening with the barrel? Maybe... Oh. Can you please pay for my therapy artworks? This is honestly like the worst park ever. No, it's not. Oh man, this is... What a beautiful game. Nope, nobody in here. Anybody in, t in this medical office? Nope, nobody in here. How about the staff? Yeah, obviously. Oh yeah, there's always somebody in here. Mechanic? Nope. I do want to see if they actually prepare food. But I guess they do. Is that apples? Yeah, maybe. But can, can, can we see a baby? Ladies and gentlemen. Okay, this is a face only a mom could love. But, um, but it's adorable. So we do have a baby, the first baby in the park. Cash is not that great, but we're making money at least. So profit is being made. However, yeah. Terribly misplaced, I guess. Maybe just having a few over here as well. Or on this. No, you know what? That's something we're going to do in the next episode. If you guys want to see more of this, please let me know, okay? Please do let me know in the comment section. And uh, I would be more than happy to record more for you guys. Because I'm in love. Look at him. <laughs> oh, man, it's 
adorable. It is so nice. How about the name on this guy? Do we see the name? Umi. Umi. And it's a male. So there might be fighting happening later on. Hopefully not. I can't get it out. But once again, thank you so, so much for watching. And hopefully I'm going to see you guys in episode 2 in a few days. It's uh, It will be a little bit of a grind when it comes to making money because of the franchise mode. But I believe we can prevail. So far, it is not that bad. Profit is being made. So once again, thank you so, so much. I'm Kralis and hopefully I'm going to see you guys in the next episode. I can't get enough. Baby, we've made a baby. Not, not, not I. Ah, <laughs> <sighs> have a very nice day. Take care, and bye bye.